we've got uh, at esmith underscore 1990. I'm assuming that's the date of birth. So it's people who wear backpacks in the crowd make my blood boil. How do I zap my revenge? Well, what happens if they, they've got something in there that they really need? So say they're, yeah, insulin if they're diabetic or, you know, an inhaler if they're, you know, asthmatic. I think there's a... I think they should exact a revenge on you. Sorry, e. Smith. I think that's a bit, a bit unforgiving to those people, you know. And maybe they're carrying their, you know, their daughter in their backpack or a dog. You know, they want to bring it to the, Yoda. bring it to the party. You know, Yoda. Yoda is in there. Yoda is in that backpack, and he will come out and he will kick your ass. Sorry, e. Smith. All right, I've got a question from, I am Joe Roberts. How am I supposed to get a beer without losing my place at the front? Help a brother out. Well, I like to think that the best way to do it is to section off an area with cones. So you put your cones out and you say, property of I am John Roberts, and then no one can get in there. You go get your beer, maybe buy a beer for the other two people that you stood next to, thus meaning that if anyone steps in the John Roberts box, they'll get the lights knocked out. So yeah, that's a good way of doing it. Keith Renz, I'm a 34 year old metal fan, but my mum still buys my clothes. Is this wrong? Yes, yes. It's just wrong. Just yeah, buy your own. Keith, buy your own clothes, mate. Come on. Right, come to a show. I'll give you. I'll give you some clothes. Stop mummy doing it. Kevin Patterson, how do you deal with unrequited love? Well, there's a right answer for this, and there's a wrong answer for this. The right answer for this is either try really hard, and if they don't reciprocate back, you should move on. You should find a new love. The wrong answer for this is force yourself upon them in a public bathroom. That's something you shouldn't do. And if you find yourself in a public bathroom forcing yourself upon your unrequited love, you will go to prison. So don't do it. At Cousin Simon, my cousin Simon apparently, uh, I want to get buried tomorrow face tap, but I'm scared it will mean I'll never get a decent job. What should I do? Don't get a buried tomorrow face tattoo. No, get it. Yeah, okay, come do merch for us. Like, it means that you, you're there, you don't need a CV or anything. Get a tattoo, come and see us, <laughs> school. <laughs> no, don't, don't, please, God, don't. Drop out of school. Yeah, drop out of school, drop out of work. Doesn't matter, Barry tomorrow will take you on. Finally, I have Robin Perkins. Good name. My boyfriend won't stand at the front at gigs because he gets too warm and his glasses steam up. Is it okay to leave him at the bar? I say f the bar and just leave him at home. And if he won't allow that, leave him completely. You can find someone better who isn't a spectacled <laughs> who will stand at the front with you. So f off Robin's boyfriend, you stand at the front. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we answered the questions.